I'm the next president of the United States of America. Donald Trump's Republican primary rally in Cleveland was relatively tame in comparison to the rally in Chicago that left four arrested and many injured. Protesters and supporters alike lined the streets into the IX Center with signs and drums. Some of the participants, on opposite sides of party lines, found themselves shouting at each other. Two Cleveland State students came out to protest today's event. Social policy with his racism, xenophobia, misogyny, um, homophobia, I mean, one of the students applauded the behavior of the protesters that shut down the rally in Chicago the night before. Silence is compliance, and we can't sit back while fascism comes alive in our city. Cleveland.com compared the rally to a carnival, with more than 25,000 people packed inside the 2.2 million square foot space decked out in Trump merchandise. Inside the arena, chants of USA were deafening. As were the boos for protesters, Trump repeatedly called out for allegedly supporting Democratic candidate Bernie Sanders. Leave. I don't. Oh, another group. All right, get them out. Thank you. Get them out. Get them out. Troublemakers. They're Bernie fans. Cleveland will be the host site for the Republican National Convention in July. The city plans on using the police force of 1,200 Cleveland officers and the support from 3,800 officers from area suburbs. Cleveland plans on using $50 million in security money approved by Congress this past December. Reporting in Cleveland, Natalie Robson, BUTV 10.